Hello everyone and welcome back to the Acumed channel. Today we're going to be reviewing the Ready Strapless N95 Respirator. These are made in the US and I'm actually really excited to try these because they have a very interesting design. They are the only respirator that we are aware of that are strapless. These are the Ready N1901S N95 respirators. It comes in a bag of 10 for $29 which makes them almost $2.90 each. This listing doesn't have any ratings or reviews. Use. So let's go ahead and try these on. This is how they look. I think that this is the bottom. I think it goes like this. Here is the TC approval, NIOSH N95, model number, lot number, and of course the manufacturer. Like I said, this is a very interesting design. This is the front and this is the back. It is also a very thin material, so it should be very breathable. I'm going to see if it has some instructions on how to put it on. Uh, yeah. Okay. So here is the instructions. Okay. So I'm going to follow the instructions. I'm going to make sure that it's sealed and you slowly start working your way down. Okay. So I was able to put it on. It didn't take as long as I thought, but it does take longer than applying a regular headband respirator. This is how it looks on. I do feel like I am getting a good seal. They do have quite a bit of collapse when um, breathing or talking. This is my first time trying something like this, so I do find it very odd. Let's go ahead and try and take them on and put them back, put it back on several times and see if you're able to. Ow! <laughs> that hurt. Okay. If you're able to have the same seal multiple times, because obviously you're gonna take the mask off several times to eat or to do several things throughout the day. Okay, this is once, let's do it another time. Let's do it three times. Let's do it one last time. Okay, so yeah, I'm definitely struggling now to place it properly on the nose bridge it's coming off on this side so i don't think that this could be worn daily and obviously you're not going to be able to wear this 10 20 times but it definitely has lost its adhesiveness within four wears so with that being said let's go ahead and see how they do with our tsi machine we're going to be testing both the filtration and the pressure drop this is our tsi machine model 8130a which is the same filtration testing machine that niosh uses to approve n95 respirators our procedure is also inspired by NIOSH, but this time we will be conducting our test differently because of the shape of this respirator. Since it's flat, we are going to be placing it under the machine as is. The results are displayed on our TSI machine monitor. F stands for airflow rate, which we test at 85 liters per minute. R is for resistance, also referred to as pressure drop. This correlates with the breathability, so the lower the number, the more comfortable and breathable the respirator is. E stands for filtration percentage efficiency. The first sample tested at 98.55% filtration with a pressure drop of 19.4, which is on the higher side of what we like to see, but let's take a look at the other samples. The second sample had a filtration percentage of 98.25 with a pressure drop of 18.7. The last sample's filtration was 98.46 and had a pressure drop of 19.2, still on the higher side, meaning that these aren't super breathable, but they still pass the NIOSH requirements. So we're back now, and as you guys saw, they did pass the filtration portion. Overall, I feel like this is a pretty cool concept. They have a good construction quality. Although we don't really have anything else to reference to because the material of this is very different than a standard N95. If you do take off your mask several times throughout the day, I don't feel like these would be the perfect fit for you. I really hope that you found this video helpful. Please let me know what mask we should test next or other content that you would like to see on our channel in the comment section below. We also have a lot of important information in our description box like our website which is acumen.com and our master testing data sheet. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in our next video.